Hi, I'm Barb Hansen, Vice President of Customer Service here at Better Business Planning and your Medicare expert. I'm here today to talk to you about some key information regarding Medicare entitlement and enrollment. As you know, normal retirement age has increased to age 66 for anyone born between 1943 and 1954. Medicare entitlement, however, has remained at age 65. This is especially important for anyone that is employed by a group that is under 20 lives. The reason for that is that if a group is below 20 employees, Medicare becomes the primary payer. Therefore, you need to make sure that you're enrolled in Medicare Part A and Part B prior to your 65th birthday so that they will then be the primary payer. You can continue to be on the group plan and that will pay secondary like a Medicare subplan. There's one important thing that you need to check out also with the employer and that is to make sure that the drug coverage on your current plan is considered creditable coverage to Medicare Part D. If it isn't, then it's important to make sure that you get enrolled in Medicare Part D so that there is no late penalties assessed to you. If you are working for a group that is over 20 employees, that group plan will continue to pay as your primary payer and there's no reason to enroll in Medicare Part A and B. What you want to do is when you do get ready to retire and go into either an inactive status as a COBRA employee or a retiree, then you need to have your Medicare A and B in force because Medicare then becomes your primary payer once you're considered inactive. If you have any questions regarding this, you can contact me at our information which will show at the end of this video. Thank you for your time.